Hey guys, Finn here, and I'm back. So, in this video, I'm trying out my new microphone. It's the um, Blue Snowball one, something like that. So let me know how it sounds. And um, so basically, this piece was done in watercolor on Strathmore cold pressed watercolor paper. I always have um, the materials uh, link, um, listed in the comment, or in the description, so, um, don't forget that, and I don't know how I'm gonna talk for seven minutes, but I'll try. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try also to do this all in one take, so, yeah. Anyway, um, so first I started off, I had a thumbnail sketch in my sketchbook, which I then redrew onto a, um, larger piece of paper. And from there, I, I taped that um, sketch to the back of some watercolor paper and used my light box, which is basically like a little tablet that shines um, light up so you can trace things. So I used that to um, trace it onto the watercolor paper and I inked it off on the light box. And so, yeah, that's a, I usually um, use a pencil and transfer the um, sketch with pencil onto the paper before I go and in ink, but this time I just wanted to try this and just cut out that step. Um, it made it a lot quicker, but it's a little dark, so it's a little more difficult to see, so I don't know if I'll do that in the future. Um, so yeah, I used, I used watercolor on this piece, and as you can see now, I got some new watercolors. I uh, used to use half pans, which are those little like cakes of paint, but I recently got some uh, watercolor tubes, and so I was just setting up my palette and everything. And so now we're um, starting with the painting. So the skin color was um, I mixed it by using some like browns and added some like dark blue. And I started by just laying kind of a flat wash with that in the beginning, before um, adding all the shading. Yeah, also, um, I apologize if you hear kind of like a buzzing sound. The lights in here are, I don't know, they always make that noise whenever you keep them on. By the way, I'm recor recording this in my closet, so yeah, because there's a bunch of clothes and it's good for soundproofing. Okay, well, I've already failed at uh, doing this in one take. This is like, what, take three so far? Oh boy, I'm only three minutes through. This is going to be... A lot of talking. So for the hair, you haven't, I haven't quite reached here yet, but for the hair for this piece, I used black Sumi ink and I watered it down to make it like a lightish gray. And I really like the color of Sumi ink. Like when it's when you just leave it pure, it's like jet black. But when you water it down a bit, it becomes more of this warm, uh, warm gray. And I really like that. It's also uh, waterproof, so that's nice. Um, oh, by the way, for the inking of this, I used uh, Micron pens. That's all. That's about all I have to say, so you guys don't have to listen to my terrible voiceovers for much longer. So I'm just going to leave you with some music, and I'll come back with a note at the end of the video. See you then.
thinking out loud before we draw a crowd Reel it in, take it easy, there's no need to scream at you I'm back. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, make sure to subscribe if you did. And, uh, yeah. Thanks for watching. Bye.